weekend. Um, my name is Kim. I'm Pokemon Breaks. Um, and today I'm super excited to open up this massive um, Pikachu V Union box. Um, they only came out this week and I'm just super excited to get my hands on this and open it up. Um, so I hope you're having a good weekend and I hope we get something cool today. Um, if you're in the comments or you're in the chat, let me know what celebrations Pokemon, um, Pokemon products you've gotten your hands on, what have you pulled, um, what are you chasing, I think it is a really fun set to get into. Um, I'm loving all the reprinted original cards, I'm loving all the full art cards, so I am really enjoying this a lot. And this V Union looks really cool um, because you get a big jumbo card, then you get four of the V Unions that match up to essentially make that artwork. So let's get into it. Um, they've done so well with the Celebrations release. I think all of the packaging is really, really nice. Even this one, they've got the little 25th anniversary logo in the plastic, which is really cool. Um, and they've actually done a lot of hard work, I think, on um, creating these packages so the promos are a lot easier to get out. So that is really cool to have to sort of punch them out and often damage your cards quite upsetting so this one comes with this really cool V union so these all go together I'll sleeve them up um, these all go together to make that same artwork as that big promo card which is really cute the weather in Australia has been kind of crazy we're like in spring, sort of towards the beginning of summer right now. Um, so we've had some really, really beautiful days with really nice like sunshine. Um, and then today it's quite rainy and a bit yuck. Um, so we've got this awesome um, Pikachu V Union. So this is the full art version of that card. Really, really cool. You've got 25 years worth of different Pikachu arts there. Um, and then these cards actually will all go together to make that exact same artwork. Get my box out of the way for a second. Um, but these ones are all going to go together to make that same art, which is really cool. And those are going to look really nice in the binder. I do need to pick up one of the um, <laughs> first partner binders so I have a way to store this because I don't actually have anything at the moment. But I don't know if you want to have a look and see if, if you've got a favorite out of those different Pikachu artworks, but it's really cool. I'm super excited about it. Um, and then within that box, you also get a code card um, as well as a Professor Burnett um, promotional card. It's not a full art or holographic or anything, but I think that's the only way to get this particular promo out of this set is to buy that Bee Union box. So really, really cool. I'm happy so far. We've got those cool promos. Um, and then also within this box, I didn't even look to see exactly how many packs we get. Looks like we've got one Celebrations, one Battle Styles, and then one Darkness of Blaze, and then three more Celebrations in there as well. So four total Celebrations packs, which is pretty good um, to go with those awesome promos. I'll get these bonus packs out of the way first and then I'll get into my celebrations because that's what I'm really excited about. Um, now I do a stream as well where I break cards for other people and what we always do on stream um, is we bless up the cards because I think that gives you better luck. So I'll continue to do that here um, with this battle style to see if we can get really lucky and maybe get one of those alternate arts or something. That would be awesome. Oh, that's weird. Well, there you go. Code card for you for anybody that wants a Battle Styles uh, box in their online TCG. Usually those are facing the other way. Um, so we've got a Water Energy, Durant, a cool artwork, Girder. Battle Styles wasn't a set I got very into. I haven't opened many of these. Um, Tower of Darkness, Single Strike, Shinx with Rapid Strike. That's a cute artwork. He looks like he's tumbling down the stairs. Esper, that's a very sweet artwork as well. Um, Rolly Coley, we've got a Salandit. I haven't seen that before, that's a really interesting artwork. It looks like one of those um, like claymation sort of ones. We've got a Corfish, 
Very cool. We've got a reverse hollow wiki. That's a funny, funny card. That's a funny artwork of wiki wiki. And last up, we've got a regular rare clay doll. Very cool. Nothing crazy out of that one. I, yeah, I haven't opened that much Battle Stars, but I didn't get crazy luck at all with it, so I'm not too surprised. Darkness of Blaze, we'll bless that up. Maybe we can get a um, Charizard. That'd be all right. That is more than make up for it. All right, four to the front. Let's see what we get. Got a Darkness Energy, a Relicant. Very cool. I played Pokemon Go as well. That's one of the regionals I don't have yet. Um, a special heat energy. Very nice. A billowing smoke greener item. That's cool. We've got a Dunsparce. Also very cool. A Bun Sweet. Like that. A Spinarak. I really like that artwork with the light in the background. It's a really cool looking card. A Panpour, very cute, he looks really happy. A Diglett, also pretty cute. A Reverse Hollow Grimer, or Grimmer, however you like to say it. Um, and last up, a Nacelgore, regular rare. Interesting, because that was a white code with that one, and we didn't get a holographic card, so a bit odd, but anyway, bonus packs out of the way. And we've got our four Celebrations packs to get into. So I'll bless that one up. Hopefully, I've already got the um, gold new. I felt very lucky to get that one. I'd really like to see a couple more of those um, reimagined cards. I think any of those would make me quite happy. Road card out of the way. Curious to see what you're chasing. Um, Cosmog, love the art on that one. The hollow is so pretty with little Lily in the background. Reshiram, very nice. I've seen a few of these. The holo pattern is really cool. Um, Palkia, the holo is kind of hard to see, but it's like a really stormy cloud background on that one. Ooh, and a flying Pikachu V Max. Very cute. I don't have this one yet, um, so I'm really happy to have it. You can see the plane in the foreground to give you a bit of idea on scale on how um, donkey that Chew really is. I don't know how he's flying. He's got a lot, a lot, a lot of balloons to help him out. But very, very cool. Going Pikachu B Max, I'm really happy with that. Out of our first pack, that's a pretty good pull. Um, second pack up for celebrations. Bless it up, let's see what we get. Maybe we'll get another one of those reimagined cards. That's what I want. I want to base set something, something or other. That'd be cool. There's a few, there's quite a few out of that section of the set that I don't have yet. Out of that subset. This one's really tough to open. Sometimes I like to think that when they're tough to open, it means they've sealed it really good because there's something extra special. So let's see. Code card out of the way. So we've got a Xerneas. Beautiful. I love the artwork on this one. That hollow is so pretty. Really like nice rainbow sort of colors. We've got a Reshiram. Again, nice hollow. Cosmog. Seen a few of these now. And last up, we've got that regular Mew. Beautiful, I do like this card. This is one of the um, tougher pulls, at least that I found from the sort of regular set. So glad to have it. All right, second last celebrations pack out of this B Union box. Bless it up and see what we get. All right, hopefully, I feel like the, the pull rates on those base set cards have been roughly 50%. So, you know, with those kinds of odds, are we gonna get one out of this box? I hope. I hope we get at least one. All right, so we've got a Ho-Oh. Very nice, I love the hollow on that one. A Lugia, nice little duo. They pair off nicely. Um, a Groudon, I love that artwork. The trainers in the foreground and the background gives it some nice scale. And a full art professor's research. I'm chuffed with that. I didn't have that one yet either, so I'm really, really happy to get this one. Beautiful full art trainer. Just some of my favorite cards to collect. So really, really happy with that. What a nice card. Beautiful. All right, and we've got one more pack out of this V Union box. Um, so let's see what we get. If anyone's in the comments, let me know um, what your favorite pulls have been 
out of this set. I've got um, an Instagram, it's the same name, Pokemon Breaks, where I like to post some of my favorite um, personal pulls. So please feel free to go give me a follow on there. Um, and I'm also Pokemon Breaks on YouTube and Twitch. So if you want to follow me there, that would be awesome. Um, all right, Cosmog, beautiful hollow. We've seen a few of those already in this box. Lugia, again, I mean, you've got to expect you're going to get repeats in such a small um, regular set. Dark Gyarados, I don't have this one yet. Really, really happy to see it. That's a really cool reimagined base set card. Very, very nice. I love the hollow pattern on these. They're so, so cool. I'm really, really happy to have that. That's awesome. And last set, what have we got? Um, a Lunala. This is another one of those beautiful new artworks for this set. I love the lily in that background. That hollow is so beautiful. Um, so that dark Gyarados, that was a really cool one to pull. Very, very pleased with that. Well, that was a really good box. I'm happy with that. Um, got some really nice cards out of those four celebrations packs. So if you get a chance, you're after that V Union, I hope you find um, some that you can pick up at a good price. But until next time, I'll see you around. Um, make sure to follow me on Instagram, Twitch, YouTube, whatever you like. Um, I'd love to keep in touch and I'll see you around. Thanks. Have a great day.